Haiti's interim prime minister taking to the airwaves with a shocking announcement Wednesday. The country's president, Jovenel Moïse, assassinated in what he called an inhuman and barbaric attack. Everyone in this country must unite to condemn what has happened. This is a painful blow to our nation. And this killing will not go unpunished. The 53-year-old Moise reportedly shot to death late Tuesday night by unknown attackers at his private residence. His wife, critically wounded, evacuated to Miami for treatment. Since taking the oath of office in February 2017, Moise had presided over a country mired in crisis and political disarray. His government burning through seven different prime ministers in four years. The current acting PM was himself due to be replaced this week by Ariel Henry, a figure close to the country's political opposition. Et... Moïse had been ruling Haiti by decree since 2020 amid a constitutional crisis exacerbated by long-delayed parliamentary elections. In February, the opposition declared Moïse's presidency illegitimate, refusing to recognize his authority and demanding his resignation, as they insisted his five-year term had expired. Moïse, though, counted that term from when he officially took power, which was delayed by a year from his original oath of office due to election irregularities. This past February, the government announced it had arrested 23 people it accused of plotting to assassinate the president. Haiti is the Western Hemisphere's poorest country, crippled by natural disasters, corruption and rampant gang violence.